Well, welcome. I'm talking to you probably because you're not here and you didn't get a chance to come this year, but this is okay because we're going to give you a little snapshot here on this video. It's the 2013 Empowering Women's Conference where like-minded women, business leaders, owners, and just wonderful people come and hang out for a whole two days here. We do it every year around the 1st of March, and I'm sorry you're not here this year. You're going to need to come next year, but definitely you can kind of take a look around and see what you're missing, and then hopefully we'll see you next year. You know, I don't, you know, I don't, I, I, I don't have the perfect answer for that, but I can edit my life for content and pick those things that are important. And so I was a little bit late this morning because as I'm walking out the door, you know, I have my children later in life. I have two twin boys that are 22 months old. My God, time flies. And a four and a half year old. And they're all talking at me, Mom, 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 like I haven't been home this week, right? I've been really busy. I've got all this stuff going on. And next week's going to be the same. I'm going to be really busy. And then I go on the road for a week. And so I'm like, oh, you guys, what are you doing? And then I stopped. And I'm like, Lisa, edit your life for content. What is the most important thing in your life right so now? So with that being said, I hope that hopefully all you'll be able to find that balance and edit your life for content and find those things that are important and just stop for a minute and breathe and go, okay, I'm on the right path. All right, so. I know that's fun to do, but remember, she is on a different path than you are. And it's hard to remember sometimes when you're stressed out and you're trying to get where you want to be quickly. But one of the things that Stephen Covey said in his book, The Habits of Highly Effective People, he said, first seek to understand and then, then to be understood. And I think that's really important. There's been so many times in my life where I've made an assumption and it was totally the wrong assumption. So until you sit down and listen to someone and understand where they're coming from, you can't really know what their life is like. So I would suggest following that advice. So there you go. You got a little taste of the Empowering Women Conference. It will be back in 2014. Workshops, panel discussion, food, fun, prizes, and it's always so much fun. I always make new friends, I get empowered, I get a little education in there as well too, and you know, I get to do a little shopping as well. So hopefully we'll see you at the 2014 Empowering Women Conference.